Look around me. Little more than sand, desert, and arid land. This is the combination of the perfect riding area, though. And that's exactly where I am. I'm Stephen Human for At Your Leisure, and I'm here at the Knowles Recreation Area, one of the greatest open riding areas in all the West. Interstate 80 is a long road, stretching from New York to San Francisco. But many would say there is no longer stretch along its almost 2,900 miles than the desert between Salt Lake City, Utah, and Wendover, Nevada. Out here, the pale world goes on forever, and it's easy to lose track of time and distance. There is one off-ramp in this area that offers a break in the form of sand dunes, mountain climbs, and an open atmosphere that has become all too rare, the Knolls. The Knolls is a great place to ride. It's about 40 miles east of Wendover, right off of I-80. Lots of sand, lots of places to camp. It's a great place to go. The nice thing about riding the Knolls is you get a little bit of everything. I mean, there's no one big pile of sand, but there's no, it's just a little bit of everything. So you can try sand, you can try trail, you can, there's some rocks out there, kind of do a little bit of everything. When I was a kid, I remember going out with my dad to uh, places to ride motorcycles and ATVs uh, way closer to home, like in this valley. And as time has progressed over the last 30 years, these little areas of riding have diminished to the point where there is really nowhere to ride. They're not as big open field areas as there used to be. And the Knolls is kind of one of those places that is not too far away that you can go ride close to home and not feel like you have to drive three hours to get to. Sand dunes butt against mountains of stone, allowing for speed on the open flats, and then a challenge as the rocks force you to change your mindset in the blink of an eye. The train opens up different opportunities for different machines as well, so no matter what ride you prefer, you'll be able to experience everything it has to offer out here in the bowls and rolling hills. When playing in the outdoors, we often notice the contrast between the colors displayed in the natural world. A quick glance at the knolls and you'd think a less colorful place would be impossible to find. That may be true on the surface, but out here there's a different kind of magnificence, contrasts between land and sky that accentuate the wonder of both. Beauty's in the eye of the beholder. I mean, if you love forests and that's it, then you're only gonna find beauty there. I mean, the desert is beautiful in its own right. Sometimes when you're out there and you think about what you're seeing is how did this get created or what made it like this, you know? I mean, one of the prettiest things in the world is a cactus with a flower on it in the early spring because it just shouldn't be there. And obviously this time of year, that beauty is accentuated with cooler temperatures, making this a very comfortable place to come in the fall, winter, and spring. Now, for most of us, the aesthetics are secondary when it comes to a place like the Knolls. We're here for the open thrill of riding our machines without limits or boundaries, the fun of skipping the trail and plotting our own course. While many such areas have closed in the last 20 years, the Knolls is still accessible and ready to be explored. The interesting thing, though, is that even in a place like this, where you'd think the solitary rider would be king, it's the relationships between friends and brothers that is the real draw. I like to ride ATVs. It's a great time to hang out with your family and friends and create really good memories. Uh, I think riding with my brother makes us closer, you know, helps us trust each other more and, you know, bond. It is fun to also use your ATV to go out and see a broader scope of what's around. Even out here, there's plenty to discover as you look out from the top of any number of peaks. Camping areas abound at the Knolls, offering the chance for families to come out and explore together. Or if you want more comforts, Tooele is just to the east and offers plenty of hotels with Wendover about the same distance to the west. I-80 may pass through some barren lands, but sometimes you'll be surprised what you'll find when you take a desert exit while towing your ATV. It's close to Salt Lake, you know, a lot closer than the Little Sahara and less people usually. It's a great place, you should come out and ride. Now Knowles is located a little bit more than an hour from Salt Lake and about 40 miles east of Wendover on Interstate 80. It's got its own exit, it's great to come out here, but remember there's no water. There are some bathrooms, places to camp, but you're going to need to bring your own water. If you've got that, you've got one of these machines, that is the combination for the perfect day. Well, I'm Stephen Hewitt for At Your Leisure. We need to take a commercial break. When we come back, we have this week's product review. 
Hey guys, if you like that video, you're going to want to watch all of our other AYL videos. You're going to want to like it, you're going to want to share it, and you're going to want to subscribe, right? See all the buttons right here? <laughs> this is what you're going to want to do, click, right? Click, click, click. on them, because we have some really cool videos, all kinds of behind the scenes stuff, bloopers of Alicia crashing and stuff. Why well, are you going to sell me out like that, Steven? <laughs> so you want to click all of these things and subscribe to our channel, because At Your Leisure is awesome, and uh, we'll see you here for more videos.